I wanted to close out. Um, close out the vlog, but it's six thirty in the morning, and um, we're getting things packed, putting things away, I'm gonna change. I look like a mess. I'm gonna change. Such a fun trip. My voice right now is a little raspy, but we are on our way um, out. So, is there anything you want to say? Huh? Anything you want to say? Oh, hi. <laughs> Just backing up. See, his voice is raspy too. So. Yeah. Go night hearing the coyotes. The coyotes. I was able to get some footage, right? Yeah. I was able to get some footage, so right now I'm just gonna change my socks, change some undergarments, baby wipe, and yeah, we're gonna actually just get ready to go. Wash your face. I look like a mess. Um, that was a great little one day trip very fast but we're not that far away from home so we are in Lake Arrowhead so San Bernardino Mountains um by somewhere near the there's a casino not Morocco but it's another casino and you go up these mountains which is a San Bernardino Mountain. They are called, I believe, don't quote me, Arrowhead. Like Arrowhead. So. Have a good time? Yeah. Laying the air out. Do you need help? No. How can you let it out yourself? No, honey, you're going to be here a long time. Okay, we'll turn it off now.
So this is what's left. Her tent is put away. Everybody's tents are still up. This is our car. And it is packed. All our camping stuff. All organized and nice. And this is our car. And that's what's left. Everything. It's a great time. Had a lot of fun. That was bonus. So that water spout there for water. And then we had a dumpster right next to us. And then there's more cars parked and more campers and if you go all the way up then if you walk like this way there's more spots and then if you walk all the way over there there's like the bathroom that way and then there's like a trail that goes all the way up it's actually cold around this side that it is on this side but And that's the other side of the camp where we would go do the bonfire and the kids and stuff. It's a really cute place. This is more like for camping for um, like winter because there's, uh, there's a lake but you can't go in the lake and fish. So you just kind of have to drive to Big Bear to go fish. So this is me this morning. The only thing, the only thing is that uh, a couple of friends of ours, uh, they went fishing, but they didn't go to Lake Arrow because it's a private lake and you have to pay so much to get in. There's a couple of the lakes around it, but you have to pay like 25 bucks on it. And then Big Bear is free. So a couple of them went to Big Bear and fish. Caught a couple small fish, um, but I didn't get a go because uh, I had school, you know, so I was doing school online. Luckily that Lake Arrow hit this area right here has Wi-Fi, so if you have something to do, make sure before you come out of here, make sure the place has Wi-Fi. That's what I did. Yeah. So we're pretty much done. I look hot mess. Let me change my hat. I look a lot better like that. Okay. So yeah, that's our trip. That is everything um, that we did. We had a really good time. Although it was one day, it was okay. We had a good time. It was so last minute. So last minute. We had talked about it, but weren't sure. And then we found out there was Wi-Fi. So we said, okay, let's just go for the day. So we came Friday evening. Well, we left Friday afternoon. But by the time we got everything we got here, it was already Friday evening about 7 did our tent we were able to go to the bonfire hang out and then we came to bed so yesterday was just one full day of hanging out fellowship lounging just you know and now um we're just packing up getting ready it's i don't have my watch on it's about seven o'clock maybe now so we've been up since six in the morning getting stuff ready um and yeah we're ready to hit the we're ready to um at home maybe grab some breakfast or something drive home grab some coffee and then start our Sunday um, yeah I'm super tired I had a rough night we heard coyotes last night so I hope I got really good footage of uh, the coyotes um, they were very active us it was so it's awesome one thing I've been wanting to do is get like coyotes or or wolves and stuff because I like wolves but I didn't hear any. I heard more coyotes, which is, it's okay. It's the same thing to me. But my goodness, it was so nostalgic. Is that a word? Is that the right word? Nostalgic? It was amazing. It's like, it was the most amazing experience to lay and hear them. And oh my God. And then it was like really cold. And so it was like real chilly. And oh my God, like the top of the car is super wet. It looked like it rained on it or something like that. Oh my god, it's just, it's really good. It, it feels really, really good right now. So, 
yeah if you see behind me that's the other campsite that was there and then we were on this side and it was such a great time but like i said this is camping for like during the winter time it's better because it's cold you can hike the trail but there's not really much to do but sit by the campfire eat take a nap relax like that this is really relaxing now if you go to like other places like kern and stuff that kern is more like the river the water so you would want to go during the summer because you're going to go in the water and be in there all day so yeah go ahead and give it a try here at lake arrowhead beautiful really beautiful place um i would recommend like i said for winter only because you can have a campfire and lounge or even fall fall is really good but yeah i'm gonna not close out the video i might close it out i'm not sure but please like subscribe thumbs up hit that bell notification so you're notified every single time i upload a new video and i can't wait to show you the opposite way of going home show you all the beautiful homes that look like mansions so i will put in footage after that on here and I will see you in the next video. Thank you. God bless you. Remember, Jesus loves you.